back. It's gonna be another banger. You already know. Dude, I'm so glad this is a thing. I don't know if it was like the Pokemon card stuff or what, but trading cards are hype again, and I'm so excited. I'm glad you guys enjoyed the last video. This one will be significantly less scuffed, and this is gonna be a long hybrid video. Because I promised you guys the NFL Sunday thing every Sunday, but last week I got completely copyright claimed by the NFL, and I could hardly do anything in that video. The amount of stuff that I wanted to put in that video that I couldn't was super frustrating. So now, I don't have a lot of footage to show you, but here's what I'm thinking. I'll do this. Here's what I have first. This is a thousand dollars worth of Panini Absolute Football. I'm gonna be honest, I don't really know like what cards, you know, are like insanely awesome. This says that there should be about four autograph cards in this whole a thousand dollar like set here, which is what I'm pumped about. I got Panini Phoenix on the way for the next opening, and then I have Immaculate and Impeccable. If you guys don't know what that is, they're like insanely expensive, but you only get like five total cards. It's like a thousand dollars for five total cards, but they're all signed and they're all insane and really rare, so I'm super pumped about that. Whoa, yes, I'm whoa, a total, whoa, whoa. total bandwagon, but listen, bro, the Detroit- ah! Okay, but listen, the Detroit Lions give me existential dread. Every day that I have been a fan for the past 22 years of my life, I've wanted to die. And now, I have moved to Los Angeles. So if I choose to bandwagon the Rams, I will. I will clap. All right, hold up. Gotta go let this thought in. Okay, let's get into the opening. Sorry, I know it was a long intro. I will be less scuffed this time. I got the dual camera setup. So I'm gonna switch over to the dual camera setup. Three, two, one. I think this is gonna go a little bit better. So what we got was four boxes. Each box comes with three of these and there's five cards in each box. I definitely like the packaging of the mosaics better, but that doesn't mean much um, because when you open this guy up, it's protected like jewelry, so I kind of like it. It makes me feel like these cards are going to be really good. Without further ado, boys, as you can see in there, our first one is a very beautiful T.Y. Hilton. I believe that corner says absolute. Same as last time, thank you guys for the help on the rarities and stuff of these cards. The Tom Brady and Justin Herbert were really rare from last time, I had no idea. Someone said I'm supposed to not touch the corners, I don't know how you do that though, I feel like it's pretty natural to touch the corners, so sorry. Oh, Raheem Mostert. Damn, these cards are a lot prettier than I thought they'd be. That packaging had me worried. Got a Raheem Mostert here, ooh, Jerry Judy, nice little Jerry Judy. Oh. Did we just get an autograph already? Is it Brian Edwards? Wait a minute. On the first pack? I did not. Oh, God damn. Oh, so it's 292 of 399. So there are a lot of them, but wait, holy shit. It's got a little piece of a football. It's got a Raiders patch. I think that's a Raiders black and white patch and then a football and a signature. Yo, let me pull this up here. That is awesome. That is so cool. And look at this, even rarer behind that is this Eno Benjamin, 13 of 100. Wow, very good start. That's so cool. Oh yeah, this is gonna take some time. That's one pack of three, of one box, of four boxes, whoa. Okay, so it does say that there's on average one autograph per box, and that was like my first. Most likely won't be seeing another autograph in this box, but hey, I like how we started anyway. Next one, right out the gates, we got the MVP, Russell Wilson, Melvin Gordon, Broncos. <gasps> no, no. That's not, that's not a sign. That is not a sign, Chase Claypool. Wait, holy shit, it's upside down and it's flipped. I think that means it's signed. It's fucking Chase. This dude's a god. Wait a minute. What am I looking at here? Oh, oh. Oh my God, it's the same thing as the Brian Edwards, but it's Chase Claypool. Dog, that is so sick. Rookie premiere, it's got the ball on it. His signature is just a big scribble, but wow, dude, I'm so geek. There's like very few rookies I'd want more than this. DeAndre Swift's the only one I could think of. Okay, I gotta pause for a hot second because I don't want to mess up my ritual. NFL Sunday, we ordered Dave's hot chicken. It is the best food ever. Now I always just order a Postmates and it comes to the house and coincidentally Postmates reach out to partner with me on a video. So of course I was excited to do it. My Dave's is on the way. I gotta grab that right now. No, you're not going out there. Dave's. No, it's not for you. Bag secured. Oh my god. Dude, Luna would implode if she had Dave's. 
me explain to you how Postmates works. Postmates is a food delivery app. Tons of restaurants around you right now use Postmates to deliver food right to your door. Of course, they have a no contact delivery option. They just leave it at the front door and then the app tells you it's there. Now, usually there's a delivery fee and that's why this deal is so insane. For new users, for the first two weeks, you will get $150 in delivery fee credit by using my code MMG. Everyone thought that was a typo last time I worked with Postmates. It is not, it's $150. When you're reviewing your order, you click promo code, you put MMG in there, $150, I'm not kidding. So to tell you guys about this, because I genuinely use Postmates five days a week, make sure to take advantage of this deal, and Postmates, again, thank you for sponsoring. All right, let's get back to it. We got a lot more boxes to open. Oh my God, what an awesome start. And then we got a Tua card here that's flipped, so presumably this is a pretty good card too. Oh my God, how common is what I'm doing? I just got a patch Tua, or, or Tua, like a patch card, right? Sorry, I don't know the exact terminology. I'm not really into this stuff, but Tua, what is the rarity on that? It has the rarity on it in that corner there. 66 of 199, it's got the Dolphins patch on it. He's playing well right now. That is so cool. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, and last but not least, dude, we got a 15 of 50 Drew Brees. Wait, is this common in these packs? Holy shit. 15 of 50, if you can read that right there. Yeah, 15 of 50 Drew Brees. That's the rarest thing I've pulled so far. Dude, the Chase Claypool is so cool. I love that. That's so badass. Let's go. All right, final pack from this box. Dude, I think there's like a rookie patch in all of these. Wait a second, did I not even, did I not even look at what comes in these? Oh, wait a second, I'm an idiot. Oh, wait, I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. It says find three autographs and two memorabilia cards per master box on average. And this is a master box. It does say find one rookie premier material autograph per master box on average. I already have got two. So we are pretty much guaranteed a signed card every pack, which is actually so cool. Next one, starting out with the GOAT, Josh Allen. So it looks like the first two are like the commons, Josh Allen, Larry Fitz. And now I believe it's gonna be like our signed card. Like that's how it's been so far. Who is that? Joe Reed. Okay, so it's another rookie, but I don't know who this is, let me be totally honest. Has he done anything reputable this year? Joe Reed, it is 16 out of 50. So it's pretty damn rare and that card is beautiful. I love what I'm looking at, but I'll be honest, I'm not sure who Joe Reed is, so. I would never fake a reaction. I don't know who Joe Reed is, so I'm sorry. Any big Joe Reed fans out there, let me know. Oh yeah, by the way, as far as giving away cards go, I tried that last video and it's such a shit show. It's so impossible. Like, there's no good way to choose people. Half the time people just make up stories to get cards. It just doesn't work. It's way too stressful and it's not fair. So I'm gonna find a different way to do that. Michael Strahan Tiki Barber and the card is flipped. So that means there's, oh, it's a double patch. 27 out of 99. Historical duels. Michael Strahan got two names himself. That's pretty cool. Definitely did not expect to see that. And whoa, what is this? 43 of 100 Thurman Thomas fantasy flashback. Oh, it's like his fantasy points. Wait, that's so cool. Is this like his PPR points? I wonder if it'll tell me. Yeah, I think that's full PPR because he had eight receptions. That is really cool. Thurman Thomas fantasy flashback, 46 points. Knowing me, I probably would have betched him. Not gonna lie. Alrighty, first pack of the new box. Let's see if we can get some sauce. Open it up with a very underrated player, Tredavious White. Next up, we got an upside down DJ Moore. Is there a reason you're upside down, sir? I don't think upside down should mean they're rare. But this DJ Moore looks pretty standard. No, it looks a little bit cooler, actually. I don't know, DJ Moore was upside down for some reason. I'm not looking at the next card yet, but I'm sure you guys can see it. Valued? What? Wait, what? Wait, what is this? Wait, I remember this dude from like four years ago. I got something really similar to this. Valued Collector. A redemption for this card can be secured in your name when you submit your request to Panini America. This redemption card must be redeemed by the expiration date listed on the back. Wait, what? <gasps> oh my God! 2020 Panini Absolute Rookie pr Rookie Premier Materials Auto Jumbo Spectrum Justin Jefferson. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god, wait, this has to be, this has to be so fire, dude. That's awesome, I don't know what it's worth, but that's awesome. Excited to find out. I will say though, the next thing I'm looking at here is a Peyton Manning, and it's upside down. So, what is that out of 99? 48 out of 99, Peyton Manning patch, wow. 
That's gorgeous. I am having really good luck right now. I'm in a very good mood. Can't forget about the boy Gabriel Davis. 24 of 25. Woo! Sheesh! 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 Super heat. All right, beautiful. That's awesome. Yup, next up, where's QB in the league? Mitch Trubisky, Xavier Howard. What do we got for the autograph? Is that Darnell Mooney? Wow, this is a Bears pack right here. Darnell Mooney, autograph. Looking kind of crispy. What's the number on that? 133 out of 149. Not as lucky as our Justin Jefferson one, but that's still really cool. Mooney, he's playing really well too, and he's got a very cool signature. Respect. Leonard Fournette. Looks like we're getting a Leonard Fournette patch. Yup. Leonard Fournette patch right there. It's 22 of 99. I like to see that, Groundhogs. Respect. Ooh, a Jalen Hurts introductions card. That man should be starting. Carson Wentz is so bad, it's atrocious. 33 out of 75. Next pack, hey, prayers up. Prayers up for this guy right here. This is the last pack in our box. I hope you heal quickly, Odell. I love you. Mark Ingram is after Odell. Ooh, so we do not get a signature this time. We got James Morgan. I don't know who that is. It's the first ever though 001 on a 199 and this michael pittman's gonna be our uh ooh! <laughs> i thought for a second i didn't get an auto michael pittman michael pittman jr i'm sorry i gotta get it right double patch got the football and the signature these look so cool these look unbelievably cool i love these and then our final player on here is a four of 75, Chris Carson, beauty. Those cards are so pretty, it's unbelievable. All right, starting now, Drew Brees. Next up, DJ Chart. I like to see a Jerry Judy. Hey, we got, this is double time on Jerry Judy, right? Didn't I already get, what did I get from Jerry Judy? Did I get a Jerry Judy signature or is it just a card? It was one of the first pack. I genuinely don't remember. I got a base Jerry Judy before, so now I have a signed Jerry Judy. 26 out of 60 on the Jerry Judy. I like it, man. Oh, did I just get the exact same Tua card? Ah, it's slightly different. It's a different patch on the jersey. I respect it. This one's out of 31 out of 49. I could just patch together a whole Tua jersey. What am I looking at? What the hell is this? <gasps> Wait, holy shit. Is this rare? I mean, it says one of one, but I don't know if it's worth anything. One of one michael thomas oh my god it's like metal dude i don't know if this is like i don't know if this is like novelty or if this is crazy rare definitely gonna have to refer to you guys on this one. Oh my god look at the other side dude what's going on that's so cool next up we're starting out with ezekiel elliott and marvin jones i like to see that I love me some Marvin Jones. Oh, Joshua Kelly. Joshua Kelly is going to be our auto or patch. Depends on what this is. Ooh, it is an autographed Joshua Kelly. How many of how many? 53 of 100. It's pretty. Damn, that is really pretty. I like him. I don't like when he takes snaps away from Justin Jackson because I need him on fantasy, but I do like Joshua Kelly. Ooh, AJ Brown. Wow. Damn, this got a lot of stuff on it. 26 to 60, tools of the trade, AJ Brown. That is a really cool card. And AJ Brown is such a stud, dude. He's so good. I love AJ Brown. And that leads us to our final, ooh, a red zone Julian Edelman. Five of five. Damn. There's only five of these cards in existence, I believe. That's what that means. I mean, that's pretty self-explanatory. Five of five red zone Julian Edelman. That's awesome. Good shit, boys. It doesn't beat my one-on-one -on -one Michael Thomas, but it's still cool. Starting this next one out, we got a double up on DJ Chark and a double up on Chris Carson. All right. Full duplicates. I like to see it. Ah, I went too fast. I think I saw Zach Moss. Wow, are we going to pull Zach Moss in back-to-back back openings? Henry Ruggs, though. We get a... What is that? 115 of 199 Henry Ruggs. And I think that was definitely Zach Moss. We're looking at a Zach Moss. Is it that one? Yup, it is. Jeez, this one's even extra heat. This one's more heat than the last one. Dude, Zach Moss is just destined to be in my packs. So I got the sign Zach Moss before. If we get another Zach Moss here, 69 of 75 sick ass signature and it's got some patches and the football on it you gotta love that man and then the last card in these packs that ends up being rare as well that is quez watkins 70 75 75 an interesting pack there for sure that leaves us with boys one final box ladies and gentlemen this pack has been cursed by matt ryan damn this one can't be good. Teddy Bridgewater. Okay. Okay. Next one is... Oh, is that Hightower? John Hightower. Looks like it's gonna be an autograph. Ooh, that's a crispy one. I like that. Wow. Whoa, this one's really rare, actually. 16 of 25. John Hightower. 
Next up, is that Jared Allen? Oh, this is an OG card right here. Very OG card. Number 69, Jared Allen. Canton Absolutes. I just respect the number. And then last but not least, what is this? Was that Mims? 23 of 25 Denzel Mims. Denzel Mims is a stud who has been banished to the New York Jets. I hope he finds a new team and continues to be a stud. This bag is the opposite of Curse because I'm looking here at a Kenny Galladay. So it's blessed by Kenny Galladay. Next up is Josh Allen. Yes, sir. Duplicate. Thaddeus Moss. Wait, that's so hype. I love Thaddeus Moss. Randy Moss's son, right? Isn't it his son? Yeah, either way, that's so cool. Bad Moss Herbert. Yo! The Herbert ones and the Burrow ones are worth a ton because I mean, obvious reasons. Hopefully rookie of the year. All right, so Justin Herbert, I assume. <laughs> That's so dope. Two of 99 rookie premier autograph Justin Herbert with all the jersey patches and a football. That's dope. I love to see that. And the final rare card. Oh, this pack was blessed. I was saying this pack was blessed and I said I wanted DeAndre Swift. I get 58 of 75 DeAndre Swift. I'm in a good mood. That is amazing. Final pack, gentlemen. Let's see how we do. Larry Fitz, Deshaun Watson, Ross. Who? Ross Blacklock, defensive tackle. I'm going to be honest. I don't know much about this guy, but I love seeing a signature. 135 of 149. Maybe not our best pack. Our last pack maybe won't be our best, but it'd be like that. Oh, is this Zach Thomas? Wait, we're going to get an OG. We get an OG Zach Thomas of how much is that? Of 199. Yeah, our last pack is not our best pack. You know what? I had an absolute blast. Another Denzel Mims. Introductions, Denzel Mims. And that will conclude the pack opening. Wow, dude, I'm so pumped to see this Justin Jefferson. Uh, lots of super heat in this one, yo. Hey, I hope you guys enjoyed. I will think of a more efficient way to do a giveaway next time. That is what I really need to do because um, just having people DM me is just super inefficient and it never works. Uh, I do love you, and um, I guess I'll see you guys in the next video. This is dope. Peace out.